people like that. My major was political science and history, and then I did take on a little bit of criminal justice criminology. I was politically active while here at Virginia Union University. I was the president of the pre-law society here. I was also a member of the debate team when they used to have one. I was a president of other clubs, but those two, I was always active and involved. On the early morning around 2 a.m. of August 2012, on the 23rd, I got into a fatal accident and my mom actually passed away from it. I was in a coma for a very long time. The doctor thought I was going to die. I was on life support and I proved them wrong. And that is the fire that drives me to who I am today. I don't make excuses for things. I love to speak for my youth. My activist work is exactly who I am. It is my message. God has been leading me. So anything I say on camera, interviews, it's God leading me to tell me, hey, say these things. I'm a bold, fearless woman who's not going to sit in the back seat. I want a seat at the table. I want a co-pilot seat, wherever seat you at, I want it. So the work that I do in this community, the work that I talk about, is really coming from a genuine place and saying enough is enough. Women should be equal. My color of my skin should not change the value of my work, should not change the value on how you treat me, should not change the value of seeing me less than what I am, which is human. George Floyd was the cherry on top of saying enough is enough for the black community. How many more people do we need to kill for us to uplift, for us the people to know their power? For the students at Virginia Union University, I'm holding them highly accountable to be the leaders, to be the voice of reasoning, the voice of education, and the voice to say, I'm well aware, I'm alert of my present and my why. At VUU, you start to know your purpose and your why moment. And I'm holding VUU students to a higher pedestal because our history, a lot of Richmond history started here. So I'm holding VUU students on a very high pedestal. When they walk out these gates of VUU, when they graduate, it's time to start educating people.